students welcome back to youtube channel sadiba ko moist vision in this video i'm going to share with you most important mcq on financial management which is very essential for mcom entrance on the guwahati university and other leading universities of assam if you have not subscribed our channel please do subscribe and if you have any query please dm me via instagram the link of which is given in the description as well as live on your screen and also subscribe to my channel Question number one: Which of the following dividend theories suggests that investors prefer current dividends because they are certain, while future capital gains are uncertain? Option A: The tax preference theory. B: The irrelevance theory. C: The residual theory. D: The bird in hand theory. Answer is the bird in hand theory. Question number two: What is the other name of wealth maximization? There is two objectives of financial management. One is wealth maximization. Other is profit maximization. Okay. So in this case, the other name of wealth maximization, the option given here, option A, profit maximization. B, value maximization. C, share maximization. D, all of the above. Answer is value maximization. Question number three. Which statement best describes the Modigliani Miller dividend irrelevance theory. Option A. It suggests that dividends are irrelevant to form value in a perfect capital market. Option B. It asserts that dividend provide valuable information to investors about future. Option C. It advocates for a high dividend payout ratio to maximize firm value. D. It states that investors prefer capital gains over dividend due to tax considerations. So answer is, it suggests that dividends are irrelevant to farm value in a perfect capital market. Okay, so the theory state that distributing part of profit that is dividend is irrelevant to increase the value of the farm in the perfect capital market. Question number 4. Which of the following is a key characteristics of a liberal dividend policy? Option A lower dividend payout ratio b emphasize on internal financing c higher dividend payout ratio d preference for capital gains over current income for investor so as the name suggests liberal dividend policy liberal means they distribute most of their dividend okay and retains only a lesser amount so answer is higher dividend payout ratio means they distribute most of their profit as dividend question number five a conservative dividend policy is most likely to be adopted by option a companies facing high uncertainty in future earnings b companies with abundant profitable investment opportunity c companies operating in a highly stable and mature industry d companies whose shareholders primarily seek current income so conservative dividend policy is just opposite of the liberal policy okay so conservative diplomacy what happened here the thing is here most of their profits are retained in the business so that they can invest the same amount to expand their business okay so the question asks which type of companies adopted this conservative dividend policy option given here so answer is Companies with abundant profitable investment opportunities, they are most likely to adopt it, the conservative dividend policy. Question number six. In an organization, the shareholders' wealth is represented by option A, the salary paid to employees, B, the market price of a share, C, the book value of a firm's assets, D, none of the above. Answer is the market price of a share means the price of a share in a market is usually represented the shareholders wealth okay suppose i have share of punjab national bank so the value the share possess in the market is my wealth okay question number seven capital structure is part of so answer is also given along with this option so option a asset structure b owner structure 
C. Financial structure. D. None of the above. The answer is financial structure. Question number 8. Which of the following is generally considered the cheapest source of finance? Option A. Equity shares. B. Preference shares. C. Debenture means debt. D. Retained earnings. Answer is debenture that is debt. Question number 9. According to the net income approach, as the proportion of the debt in the capital structure increases, the weighted average cost of capital, option A increases, B decreases, C remains constant, D fluctuate. Answer is decreases. Question number 10. The net income approach advocates for option A no debt in the capital structure, B a moderate level of debt. C. 100% debt financing is optimal. D. Irrelevance of capital structure. So the theory net income approach says that financing through debt is very essential form for firm to increase their value. So the answer is 100% debt financing is optimal. Question number 11. The traditional approach is compromised between which two other approaches? Option A. Trade of theory and agency cost theory. B. Net income and Modigliani Miller theory. C. Net operating income and packing theory. D. Net income and net operating income theory. Answer is net income and net operating income theory. Question number 12. A project should be accepted if it's Net present value and PB is option A equals to 0, B less than 0, C greater than 0, D negative. Answer is greater than 0. Means the value we find by calculating NPV if it is greater than 0, the project should be accepted. Question number 13. According to the internal rate of return criteria, a project should be accepted if its IRR is option A equal to the cost of capital, B less than the cost of capital, C greater than the cost of capital, D negative. Answer is greater than the cost of capital. Okay. Question number 14. Which of the following is generally considered the most Reliable capital budgeting technique for mutually exclusive projects. Option A. Payback period. B. Accounting rate of return. C. Internal rate of return. D. Net present value. Answer is net present value. Question number 15. Sunk cost in capital budgeting are option A. Relevant for region making. B. Not relevant for region making. C. Always included in NPV calculation. D cost that can be recovered from the project answer is not relevant for region making means the sunk cost normally means the cost that have already incurred and we cannot recover that cost question number 16 if the npv of a project is positive its profitability index will be option a equal to 0 b less than 1 equal to 1 b less than 1 c greater than 1 d 0. Answer is greater than 1. Question number 17. A project whose cash flows are not affected by accept or reject decision for other projects is known as option A. Mutually exclusive project. B. Independent project. C. Dependent project projects. D. Contingent project. Answer is independent project. Independent projects are such projects that are not affected by the rejection or accept, acceptance of uh, other projects question number 18 wealth maximization focuses on option a short term earnings b increasing the overall value of the business entity over time c maximizing accounting profit d minimizing expenses answer is increasing the overall value of the business entity over time Question number 19. According to Walter's model, if the firm's return on investment is greater than its cost of capital, the optimal dividend payout ratio should be option A 100%, B 50%, C 
zero percent d it depends on the earnings per share answer is zero percent question number 20 a stock dividend results in option a an increase in the firm's cash balance b a decrease in the number of outstanding shares c a increase in the number of outstanding shares and a decrease in the per share value d a decrease in retained earnings and an increase in paid up capital answer is an increase in the number of outstanding shares and decrease in the per share value stock dividend means when company intends to issue dividends in the form of stock it is called bonus share such share is also known as stock dividend so when they issue stock dividend the outstanding number of outstanding share increases but the value per share decreases okay so in this video i have tried to pro provide important mcq on financial management which is very essential for pgt entrance under guwahati university so if you have any query you can dm me via instagram the link of which is given in the description as well as live on your screen and subscribe our channel thank you very much joy hind joy akham